All right, so I believe we want to head this way first. Hopefully the Pikmin don't get drawn to the grass, please and thank you. Okay, oh, am I gonna lose Pikmin because of the bridge glitch? <sighs> How's it going everybody and welcome back to another episode of Pikmin! Last time we returned to the impact site with all three Pikmin types and we got the final part within the area and we boosted our Pikmin numbers significantly as you can see on the bottom of the screen. In this episode, we're going to be returning to the Forest Naval because there are quite a few parts I can still get in here. My goal is to get two parts because there's a whole lot of things involved with getting the remaining parts, at least the easier ones I could get right now. So my goal is two. Hopefully I can achieve that goal. It's going to take a lot of micromanaging. Without any further ado, let's land. Our first priority, as with every day, is to get all of our Pikmin out. I think I'm gonna get out, let's say 35 reds. Then we'll get out, um, I guess we'll get out 23 blues. We already have seven, I think, on the field still. And then the rest are gonna be yellows. So 35 yellows, 35, 30, and 30, okay. Got everybody that we can currently have. Okay, so what we're gonna wanna do is we're gonna wanna head this way first, I do believe. Uh, hopefully nobody gets stuck on anything. Don't go on the grass, guys, please and thank you. There's nobody on the grass? All right, we still have everybody, good. Just had to double check. All right, everybody come follow me. Come on, get up, yellow. You're a flower, how did you trip? Anyway. The first thing we're going to want to do, we're going to dismiss our Pikmin. And the first thing I want is to get all of my reds, or at least a majority of the reds. There we go. Alright. Uh, reds and uh, yellow. We'll get all the reds. Come on. And what the reds are going to do is really quickly, we're going to come over here. And we're going to have our reds destroy this fiery blowhog. Or at least try to take him out very easily. Although, yeah, they do get scattered. But we're going to have the red Pikmin deal with the fiery blowhog. They'll be taking that out in no time, actually. But what we're going to want to do next is gather our blues, a good majority of them. And we're going to want to take them over this way. Actually, let me really quickly... Uh, no, you, you do that. But I'm going to dismiss... All right, now they can, they can take that, it's whatever. All right, with our blues, we're gonna wanna head this way and avoid the Wally Wog. Oh God, the Wally Wog is scary. Anyway, with our blues, we're gonna wanna come over this way through the water and we're gonna have them start building this bridge. All right, there we go. They should take that down very easily. All right, so the scary part of this, of course, is the Wally Wog. And the Wallywog is actually probably going to keep following me, so I should be very, very careful. Uh, oh god. Hopefully yellows don't go attached to that. Okay, I think we're good. Yeah, we're, we're good. We are good. Alright, so... Next, we're going to have the remaining reds over here start working on this. Wow, they really got tossed up there, didn't they? Alright, so real quick, we'll have our reds and our blues, I guess. We'll have them start working on this wall. Now, they aren't going to be sitting there forever because I do plan on getting those bombs that you saw uh, over by where I left the blues to make the bridge. We're going to be getting those, and it'll help us with shortcuts, especially that specific part. Oh god, this is super scary because of the Wally Wog. Oh boy. Alright, we're going to toss our yellows up here. Gonna, they're just going to be chilling right here. They're going to be probably migrating to that part, if i got to be honest. But everything should be okay. We'll take the geyser up here. And because the Pikmin tried carrying it, we get a special entry. The Pikmin are carrying our spo the Pikmin that are carrying our spoils to be seem to be milling about in one place with their loads. 
It appears their path back to the Onion is blocked, and faced with what seems to be an insurmountable obstacle. They have lost their focus. This is unacceptable. I will have to determine what is blocking their way, and do what I can to resolve the problem. Well, the only way to resolve this problem is to whistle them back, and have them start working on the bridge. Okay, and this is the gravity jumper! I thought I could sneak past it, but I guess not. By manipulating the forces of gravity, this key component gives me the final boost I need to make the jump to super light speed. Good thing I found it! Yes, it's a very good thing that we found it. Alright, why is that one blue not working on the bridge? Come on, blues, you gotta work on the bridge! Gotta work on the bridge, buddy. If I whistle them now, obviously, they'll be interrupted, so I don't want to do that. And they're pretty much done with the bridge anyway, so... Let's have them solve this. Come on. After this, we don't really need that many blues, so we'll, we'll not have these guys do much once we're done. Come on, blues. There we go. Gotta help finish this off. And then, I need to go back for reds, actually, because I am going to need them to carry that specific ship part. Because, obviously, the fiery blowhogs are all over this place, and having yellows or blues take that is not the smartest idea. So, we're gonna take our reds here. Come on, guys. And our yellow. There was a yellow that went over there, I knew it. Uh, guys, no, no, no. <sighs> Come on. You had to get your high, and now you just caused everything to go bad. Uh, oh god. The Wally Wog is scaring me. Oh, that's a indiscipline beetle. Oh god. That scared me. I thought for sure that it was the freaking Wally Wog, and I was about to have a conniption. Okay, uh, I actually need to have the reds come with me, so reds, come on. Okay. Come on, my little reds. Oh no, the Wally Wog. Uh, is it gonna come this way? I need, I need to attract it. Come on, Wally Wog. Or not. It, I don't know what the Wally Wog's doing. Anyway, uh, I need them to carry that. So, Red, you get thrown up there and you go carry the item. Because you're gonna need to carry it through all of the fire and the flames and have it carry on. Are you... You guys gonna go to the... Is there not enough of you? What? Guys! Why aren't you carrying that? Guys, why didn't you attract to it right away? Oh, goodness me. Come on. Carry the item. Thank you. Alright, uh, can I put the last red on there? Come on. Red. There you go. Okay. Uh, no, I don't need all of you carrying that. Dang it. I should have attracted the other ones first. No, 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 guys, 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 sit over there, sit over there. You know what? I'll just have them do that, whatever. Okay, reds, go on this, please. Thank you. <sighs> Man, it's so exhausting dealing with the reds. Okay, you guys do that. Fine, cool. Okay, now that I have all of these guys, let's go ahead and swarm them if we need to. Get some more flowers. Okay, come on. Anybody else? Anybody? I think one yellow ended up getting that last one. Alright, so, we're gonna actually take our blues, and we're gonna place them over by uh, the area we were just at. So, oh, I think I went the wrong way. Oh god, no, not that way, not with the shear grubs. Oh god, I'm getting lost. Okay, I, kn I know where I am now. Oh, the Wally Wally Wally. Wally Wally. Okay, we're fine. We, we're, we're fine. We're, we're okay. You guys, come here. Work on this again. I want the blues to start working on that. You, go over there. I want the blues to work on that. And the yellows, I'm gonna take over by the bombs as soon as I get back over there. Don't mind me, everything is fine. Come on, yellers. Come on, yellers. Come on, my sweet yellers. All right, there we go. Come over here. Be very careful, because there is water over by this area, so I'm gonna just toss these yellows over in here, and hopefully they all find the bombs. Hopefully they find them very easily. Okay. 
got a good amount of bombs. I'm super scared to do this, but I'm going to attract inside of that just to see if they get any extra bombs. It looks like they did. Okay. I don't want the bridge glitch to happen because a bridge glitch did happen when I tried recording this the first time. This is the only time I've restarted a recording just because it happened so early into the recording that I honestly needed to do it. It was gonna drive me insane if I didn't. Anyway, uh, so we do have a couple of things we can take down with these bomb rocks and also we get our ship part finally back. That took a little while. I thought it was going to take a little while longer, but nonetheless, the gravity jumper is back in the ship and the dolphin can swim gracefully through the sea of stars like a dolphin. I've now recovered 11 out of 30 parts. If I find just one more, I should be able to increase my ship's capabilities. And hopefully we will be doing that. So the first wall I want to destroy is actually this one because it's basically right in the pathway and everything is over here. So if I manage to destroy all of this, that will definitely help us. So let's toss our bomb rocks there. Okay. Do that. And we should just be able to toss two more maybe a third one oh god why didn't why didn't that bomb go off um did you not leave, why did that we not leave the bomb there that was a little weird all right toss that one that might be the final one no one more and we still have four more bombs okay uh well with our four bombs i think i want to destroy this now not you plain yellows, I need the bomb yellows. Okay, leave three bombs there. I said three, not two. Okay, oh god. Oh god, yellow, get out of there. Oh my god. That was super scary. All right, and the last two bomb rocks. There we go. That's unfortunately not gonna fully take it out, but I got this main pathway out of the way, so I'm honestly pretty content with that. However, I shouldn't have done this because I needed my reds. Come on, reds. Come on. I'm going to need you guys to get over here. Come on. Come on. Come on. All right, there we go. Got everybody. Everybody. The blues are already over in this one area. Come on, you stupid Pikmin. Get over here. Come on, you stupid red. You stupid red. Get over here. Thank you. Okay. I'm going to do this just to help them not get stuck I say that as a flower yellow was stupid okay I need to be very very careful because obviously there's the water there oh the blues actually took that out all on their own well mostly on their own not bad okay so I need to put the perspective up a little bit because uh, I was pressing the wrong button because I need to bring all the Pikmin through here Yes, through fire geysers, which means this is going to involve all three types of Pikmin. Well, I kind of spoiled that, but this is a puzzle coming up here that basically utilizes all three Pikmin. And it is very, very vital that you do this. So definitely get all your Pikmin onto the bridge. And also, actually this can wait. Uh, I think I can actually get both parts back today. I am going to need the blues almost immediately, though, in order to do it. Actually, I don't think I have enough reds, though. That's the problem. I think I'll be able to definitely get one part back today, but it's going to be very, very close. Maybe I can get the other one halfway to the base. It really, really depends. Alright, first I need this bridge to be completed, though. It's going to be very dicey to get the one part back, but I think I can do it. I'm going to try to get two back, but I can definitely get one back. Okay, come on. Build the bridge, guys. Come on. Build the bridge. We're so close. We are right there. Come on. Build the bridge. Build it, build it, build it. There we go. Nice. All right. We're going to want to separate our Pikmin. And we're going to need the blues... Gonna need the blues to go ahead and activate this geyser up here. Come on, activate it. There we go. All right. With our yellows, we're gonna toss... Actually, I got the perfect amount. We're gonna toss 15 yellows up here. 
Okay. Very, very nice. Go up. Come on. Up the geyser. Take our yellows. And we're going to toss them up here. Okay. Oh, no. My yellows fell. Shoot. Uh, crap. Crap, crap, crap. Crap, 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 crap. Crap, 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 crap. Crap, 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 crap. I might not be able to get all the parts back. Are you serious, you stupid... Okay, I got Pikmin to do that. Oh, no, they're drowning, they're drowning, they're drowning, they're drowning, they're drowning, they're drowning. They're drowning, they're drowning, they're drowning, they're drowning. I lost one. Okay, that's fine. No, no, no. Uh, Actually, no, this is fine. This is fine, this is fine. No, no, no. Don't pick that up. Don't pick that up. Don't pick that up. Don't pick it up. Ah, uh, you stupid yellows. You stupid yellows. This is my Libra. My daughter gave this to me. It's named after her astrological sign. My sweet little girl. I wonder what she's doing right at this moment. Probably regretting everything. Okay, well, unfortunately because I screwed this up really royally, I'm not going to be able to get back all... I lost a second Pikmin? When did that happen? All right, well, I got the Libra down from the ship. That's fine. I was hoping to get a second part, but I was playing really foolishly, so that's really my bad. I played the whole last part of this day stupidly. However, because I did complete the bridge and I got the Libra down already... It should be fairly easy to grab it the next time we come to the Forest Naval. Which will be tomorrow, because I still don't want to go back to the Forest of Hope, and honestly getting the last couple parts, or at least two extra parts again in the Forest Naval, will help us be able to fly the ship to a different area, so that'll be... Where did I leave a red behind? Seven days since impact. The Pikmin always carry their prey back to the onions. Close observation indicates that taking food pellets to the onions of the same color results in the release of larger numbers of Pikmin seeds. I've also found ways to group Pikmin by color. I can hold A to grab one, press B to swap one out, or I can press A to grab one for a moment, or press C to dismiss them into colored like groups. We lost two in battle. I guess we lost them maybe to a Wallywog or one of the Blowhogs, I'm not sure, and then we left one behind. Honestly, though, I'll take that and unlike losing, like, 20 to a Bulborb, so that's perfectly fine by me. Although, the one time we do come here, we are gonna be taking on a boss for a ship part, and it's, uh, it's not gonna be pretty. Anyway, next time on Pikmin, we will return to the Forest Naval, and we will hopefully gather two parts for sure. I might end up trying for four, though. Until next time, though, thank you for watching, and I will catch you later.